A long wind-up for the first pass saw him winding Shell Ladybug up to 7,000-plus revs, and the timers confirmed a speed of 181 miles an hour, or 291 kilometers an hour. He was going to be short of the target 300 kilometers an hour, but quick enough to beat Peter Knight's existing record of 283, provided the return pass was similar. The second pass was just slightly slower, at almost the same engine speed. He stopped the clocks on a time indicating 177 miles an hour, or 275 kilometers an hour. The average of 179 miles an hour, or 288 k's, bettered the required minimum 1% improvement on the old mark, and Wellington's Michael Southwood had his world record. That is, until someone else decides to attack him.